So I continue this le lesson about test-driven development in Python. Um, because I just showed how to do to develop the function is zero in Python, uploading it to GitHub and those things. Questions are, do developers really do this? Because you could argue like, whoa, this is such a simple function. Is it worth um, to go through these five cycles of test-driven development? The answer is yes, they actually do that. And then um, most of those agree that it feels trivial for such simple functions to do it. Um, and we do take shortcuts after a while. Um, but still, it gives it gives a solid, simple methodology you can just follow without thinking. Um, that works for complex things, but works for simple things as well. So I notice for myself, I always do it, regardless of how simple it is. So now there's an exercise for you, which is to write a function called isEven. So create a GitHub repository called isEven share the URL of your repository with the teachers. That's me, just put it in the chat or uh, send an email to, uh, to one of the teachers. Develop this function is even using test-driven development. And what is important, try to be exemplary, really try to follow the red, green, blue part of the cycle. And at, at every time you are at the blue part, push it to your GitHub repository. In that way, we can all see that you developed your code in steps. Uh, and that is the whole point, to get used to that test-driven development. It's not about getting this function running as quickly as possible, because it's trivial. Um, after that, we'll take a look at some repository history of some students after the break. Also, if you're done, there are some other functions we'll develop later. Um, one of them is called isProbability, um, which is a function that determines if a number is a probability, which is the chance of something happening. Um, so if you have time left, write the isProbability function in the same way. Um, that means it's, uh, so good luck, and uh, well, maybe in real life it would be a break now and we'll answer your questions, but for now, Good luck solving this problem. And again, try to be exemplary. It's not about getting those done quickly. All right, good luck. Hey, Dor.